Nice. So we're back inside College Mania 2. This is an exciting edition simply because we pump in, we vibes in, we chilling inside the first big fet for the second semester. All right, it's actually put on by the UV Guild of Students, Soka Glow, your boy Junior K, the University Prince. Gotta big up all the tertiary crews if you're just joining us. You know what I mean? Right now, though, you all know that we put in random people on this spot. It doesn't matter. You know what I mean? And you see that guy over there? You see that guy over there? We're going to pay him on this spot. We're going to put this man on this spot. You know what I mean? The big bad wolf, Mr. Slaughter, the girls them Arthur. Welcome to College Mania TV. Ah, thank you so much for having me. So it's simple tonight, you know. I want to find out from you some of the most memorable and some of the worst experiences you had while attending school. Oh God, worst experiences. But still, we had to get thanks even with the worst. They put me in Macy and I always wanted to do principles of accounts or principles of business. So that was like a, was, at first it, it was really bad, but then, Eventually, having a trade is a very good thing to have into this society. So, um, I give thanks, but it wasn't my choice. Um, greatest experience in school, being able to sing and people acknowledge me for that. That was one of the greatest things ever because it helped Doggy Soda do the transition from being a DJ to being an artist. And then coming back to songwriting and being around music, so that was one of the greatest. Nice, and you're doing big things. So, what school you attended, though? Oh God, I went to I I we are going to college. You know? I went back to a junior second, then I went book. But I went book when it was at five years. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? But a lot of young people look up to you still too. So tell them something positive now. Nah? Most definitely, stay in school, get education, and all this elevate yourself. It's very very important that you do that. Nice, the college many of viewers here that stay in school, education, I'm telling you all this is key to a successful tomorrow. Doggy Slot, it's time for us to jump inside this week's E-Spot. So Ms. Will here for College Mania TV with none other than... Cupid, what's up? Now, after winning the next election competition, let me know what's the vibes. Well, everything cool, but the thing about it is that um, the winning of the next election competition just came as a shock to me. Yeah. Because I was never interested in being on radio, I was never interested in being a radio personality, mm -hmm. an MC. I'm only in music like about a year now, like in terms of career wise. Okay. Alright, so after the next election competition, it actually was a shock, as I said before, because the first time I actually did like a stage performance mm. with Inside Spokers, which is now Fusion. Right. Where that's where I won the competition before. So it just basically it's a whole. The first, the first. Yeah, the first time I actually went on stage, I did a stage performance as using Hennessy and stuff, but whatever, we won't get into that. Yeah. It's just basically, it's just also shocking how I'm. Like the first time I actually reached on stage. You did so well. Exactly. And then the, the, my career basically started from that same particular spot, that same speech. Right. After the next election competition. So that's a good place to start. Yeah, oh, I guess so. I see some myself. <laughs> but then if you weren't doing the radio thing, what would you have been doing? Um, I probably would be more miserable. <laughs> I'm telling you. Because the thing about this is that I never understood what I wanted, like what my passion was. Right. And it just came to me, just said that, like, the competition just came to me, like, hey, Funny enter, enough. win, wow. So I'll probably just be more miserable. Or I'll just be doing my studies, which I currently do now, okay. at Costa. Um, I'll just be probably going to school, chilling home, relaxing, stuff like that. So, in that case, with all this love, I'm going to leave you alone. And in the meantime, <laughs> This is Ms. Will for College Mania TV. I'm on it. Big up, Summer Girl. Ms. Will, thank you very much for that eSport. All right, this is College Mania 2 inside the Soka Glow UV Center Gustin campus. Right now, we just threw in men in the fire again, you know. 645, big, big, big all boy group, you understand? They just rip up these stage. Guys, welcome to College Mania TV. This ain't no interview thing. So, you see, they set a swag down thing all year, and I not on that. You know what I mean? Right, I want to know from you all what's your love? I want to hate the most about school. Well, first of all, I don't know six or five is you students. I mean, all alma, alma mater, you know, right, right, true. But what we love about school is the vibes, you know, after you is student done study and you're ready to party, it's just vibes, it's just partying. We're going hard all the time and then we still getting A's. Love about school. Why? Tell me what tell me what What we hate about you is that it had a finish at one point, right? Because you see that pace, you don't get nowhere else, anytime, any place else, Ras. Big up to you, we big up to the whole of the college media pussy. We love all you, we support it, we endorse it. Yeah, man. Don't feel again, we know. Don't feel again, we know. Nice. 
how about you eat? It's the magnificent, wonderful, beautiful girls. The girls. They're beautiful. I love it. Oh, I hate about you well class on them kind of thing. But I still get my A's, I still get my degree. Big up to you, big up to the guild for having we here. Thank you very much. Big up to College Mania. Big up to my boy here. Watch me, we doing it big, we doing it large, we doing it, we doing it hard. You understand what I'm saying? Right, so my college many of you are teens, young adults, and of course university crews you heard from 645 party line sing, nothing wrong with that. But get your ears, you know what I mean? Get those graces, study hard, decide for us to jump inside this week's corporate 101. Check it out. Hi, my name is Odessa Alexander and I'm the head of stakeholder relations at Cipriani College of Labor and Corporate Studies. The college was founded in 1966 and the focus at the time was labour and cooperative studies. We have since grown into a number of different disciplines which include the traditional areas of academia as well as still labour and cooperative studies. We have human resource management, we have occupational health and safety, we have project management, we have uh, public relations and marketing, OSH, Occupation, Health and Safety, that's one of our main programs here at the college as well. That's just a few of the offerings that we have. The entry level requirements are five CXC courses with math and English. We have a 10 Saturday program which essentially offers students the ability to come to the college, well, for 10 Saturdays, 40 hours, and from that you are able to graduate into the certificate program. So essentially that sort of take, takes care of people who don't have the five O levels, and you're able to move up, up to a degree level as a matter. You can visit our website at www.cclcs.edu.tt or you can call us at 2 continues after this.